Yo, good morning. Hope everybody's doing well today. I'm going to get right into the building. Thanks for being here in advance. If you're on YouTube and this uh, anything gets muted, it means the song was copyrighted. <clears throat> so, yeah. Good morning. How's everybody doing today? What up, Lizard? How's it going, dude? All right, let's get some building. I love this song. You love the new short? Really? I felt like I was being a butthole. What's up, E. Gribbeth? Good morning. Firefist, really? You love the new what? What does that say? You love the new short? You think, dude, people thought I was being a dickhead, I think. I think people thought I was being mean, Firefist Saban. I was actually just talking smack. I was just talking smack. God, I love this song. Talk smack to you, E. Gribbeth. I will talk smack to you, E. Grib. People thought it was mean. I had to do an apology clip. <clears throat> I'm not apologizing for nothing. <laughs> Hell yeah, truth hurts. Oh my god, I feel so bad, Firefist Saban. Was it mean or was it. How did you take it? Did you take it like I was being a, like a butthole? Like I was being mean? Or do you think it was okay? I kind of felt like I was being mean. <laughs> I hope I wasn't being too mean. I wasn't trying to be too mean. <laughs> People get pissed though. E. Griffith underscore says he is a butthole. It's in the name. He is a butthole. It's in the name. <laughs> Oh, I see, Lizard. I understand. <clears throat> yeah, I understand. You, you know, I understand about that, you know. You're wanting your rights for your kids. I totally understand, brother. <sighs> All right, let's see what we got. Do, 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 do. I really loved it, man, because I thought that everybody should understand that these games are difficult and they're not going to be for everybody. Yeah, I mean, <clears throat> I appreciate you giving me your feedback, Firefist Saban. Really. I got a lot of comments on that video. I haven't even read through all of them yet. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of wild. I need to look at something really quick. I want to find this one block. There's this one block I need. There we go. It's right beside this one.
What's up, Brian? How's it going today? How are you? Good morning. But yeah, Firefist Saban, I really appreciate your feedback. Am I doing a Sweet World 2? Mm, not right now. Um, the stuff I'm building now is just random stuff. Uh, I have thought about doing some some Sweet World 2, though. It'd be fun. It'd be really fun to make a Sweet World 2. Did you play Sweet World? Yeah, I want to use this block. But I want to use it after the checkpoint. So we're going to put that block right there. We're going to also put one over here. I can't forget to put a sprite killer, though, in the way. So that way... Took you seven hours to beat it the first time you played it? Nice, dude. So you're pretty new, then. Seven hours isn't too bad. I mean, 12 exits? It's not terrible. That's awesome, man. Big GG. I hope it was fun. For a new player, could you say that uh, it was uh, frustrating at all, or do you think that it taught you anything? And it's okay, you're not going to hurt my feelings if, if you think it was bad. Definitely tell me. I, I personally think the second level was too hard. Um, I've seen a lot of players struggle on the second level, and it makes me feel bad, because I I feel like I maybe introduced regrabs a little too early into that hack. But... At the same time, I've seen a lot of people, you know, play it and stuff. Second level was easy to you. Oh, really? Nice, dude. Yeah, a lot of people struggled on the second level, so it made me really nervous. I was like, oh no, what have I done? <clears throat> Let's see what we can do here. Okay, we're going to jump onto this one. We're going to wait, jump up, jump again. But yeah, man, I'm really glad you enjoyed it. Um, if you're looking for a challenge that's a little bit different than Sweet World, um, a sticky situation is a really good, really good hack that I've I made uh, with another creator named Dot Cookie, and then um, I have another hack called Super Dank World, which is not too bad. Um, it's pretty tough, but it's got a lot of like shells. So have you been working on that one? Nice, dude. That's awesome. I'm glad you're enjoying them. Daddy B, how's it going? It's going good. What's up, Phyrexium? I hope you're doing good today. Good luck building. Thank you. I, I am, I am, I've got some ideas flowing. I'm very excited to see what we're doing today. How are you doing today, Phyrexium? I got Sweet World down to 26 minutes and 12 seconds. Heck yeah. You should play Super Dank World. You might like it. You got 11 Subi Krubers and the Yubi Tubers last night. Now you can get the wooden play button. <laughs> Poro Despair. What is this sad guy? <laughs> Regrabs are not too bad for me. Gamble was your third hack. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's a beautiful hack. It's a really well-made hack, too. Really cool jumps going on in that hack. Okay, so we're going to get here. We're going to throw it. Definitely going to need another saw. Sheltopian Gamble, love yourself, top four. Nice, dude. 
You're gonna make ramen? Delicious. It's me knowing I won't beat Sweet World even if I play 30 hours. You should have had, um... You should have had, uh... Crumpy play, uh, Sweet World, Egrib. I bet Crumpy would have played- I bet Crumpy would have enjoyed Sweet World. Okay, let's see here. He did beat it? Really? I'm dumb. You know, when I was saying that just now, I thought, didn't he play it? And then I thought, maybe he did. Maybe I'm just dumb. I just can't remember everything. <laughs> I just can't remember everything, sadly. Okay, we're gonna throw, we're gonna spin off, we're gonna spin to this. Yo, good morning, Krishna. Also, if you guys are on, um... On YouTube, I'd really appreciate it if you like the stream. <clears throat> Seventh level was your your least favorite level in Sweet World. What level was that? Seventh level. What is it like Zwerbel Sprung or something? I think. <clears throat> it's hard for me to remember the the order. Did Crumpy enjoy Dank World Egribeth? in one checkpoint. Dang. Hey, you know, I'm glad he got the checkpoint. Did he have fun? <clears throat> or was he suffering the whole time? Started to play with default controls as you suggested. Why? I don't know. I don't know why. This looks like level five in Sweet World. Yeah, this is. I, I use like the same palettes. I I'm not the best at palettes, so I just kind of. Uh, actually, you know, let's just see what we got going on here. I've been building a lot this morning. Let's just see what we got. Let me change the size of this so you guys can actually see it. Yeah, that should be good right there. Dent. Pff, played some sticky situation, man. I've been loving it so far. Yo, Groovy Tony. I hope you've been doing great, bro. Yeah, sticky's cool, man. It's a, it's a cool hack. I'm really proud about that hack. I love that hack, man. It's an interesting hack. It's different, for sure. It'll just cause issues later on because... You're gonna be, it's gonna be easier for you to spin jump, and then sometimes whenever you have, <clears throat> sometimes you have to use your L or your R button, you know? Beating 25 hacks in 9 months, that's awesome. Doing good, thanks man, I hope you're doing good, well, uh, dude, thank you Groovy Tony. Man, I've been, been wild lately, man. <clears throat> it's going wild lately. Giga Cappy. It's going wild lately, brother. But it's good. It's going good, Tony. Okay, I think I want to... Yeah, add more blocks here.
Where's the face cam? I just have it off today. Do you want it on? Sometimes I just like to have it off. Because then nobody says, you look tired. Because I probably do look really tired today. with underscore says you sound tired well i guess i better mute my microphone then also <laughs> i look tired huh you guys look tired my gameplay looks tired oof this is nasty why is this so nasty this is a nasty set of blocks here. Whoa. This is disgusting. Why? You know what? I've got a better idea. Something smells weird. I need to drink some of my coffee too. We're all tired. You know what? I got I got something to tell you guys. Hang on a second. I got something to tell you guys. You guys listen real closely, okay? Listen real good, okay? You listening? I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Dude, I can't believe you played MFC. I, I need to watch your VOD. What the hell? I didn't even know you played it. Dude, I haven't been able to watch as much Twitch lately. Topaz, I hope you're doing great today. Yeah, I'm sorry I, like, literally was cooking dinner yesterday, and then your stream cut out, and then my wife got home, like, right after that, so I had to stop watching, so I'm sorry. But I hope your stream was good, Topaz. I felt like a dingleberry just coming in and saying, hey, then you started talking to me, and then boom. It was over. I need to freaking, I need to check Twitch more often. I've been listening to a lot of YouTube lately. I've been listening to a lot of, uh, just like, uh, just like online essays. Uh, I've been listening to a lot of Wendigoon. You guys like Wendigoon? He, like, talks about, like, really, I, I listened to, like, an hour and a half video about him yesterday talking about Dante's Inferno, Seven Layers of Hell. <laughs> if anybody wants to talk about that book, that's pretty, uh, it was pretty interesting. Yeah, he's really good. I've never really listened to him before, but... I've recently really got into it. But yeah, he is really, really cool. I thought the uh, Dante's Inferno book was pretty interesting. You know, I've never read that book and I don't plan on reading it. <clears throat> but it's pretty neat. You have Dante's Inferno in English and Italian? You never read it? You just own books? There's nothing wrong with that. You'll read them at some point. I have a bunch of books too that I don't read. <laughs> I love those kick things in the hacks. Kick things? What do you mean kick things, Brian? Yeah, it's pretty It's pretty early for me too. What time is it for me? It's, it's 2.55 2 in the morning. I actually thought it was pretty interesting, um, Dante being able to describe all these different, uh, torture methods. It's kind of interesting. I thought it was also kind of interesting how his character changes throughout the story and, uh, you know, is, is kind of like understanding and not really wanting to see these people being tortured. And then over time, you know, the influence of God or whatever makes him, you know, very, uh, <laughs> very mean, where he doesn't, doesn't care anymore about the, the souls in hell. Wall shell jump intended by Nintendo developers, or was it discovered? Uh, I think it was discovered, 
at some point by uh, a player. I'm not sure what player, though. Ah! And Tony, I'm glad you're enjoying the MFC, man. I'm really glad you're enjoying it. Uh, buddy crying. <laughs> Oh my god, okay. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be harder than, uh, than Dank World, probably. But I've got some easy levels, too. I don't know, I might... I need to try to, like, make... a Sweet World 2. I was talking about that yesterday, actually. It'd be really fun to make a Sweet World 2. Shoot! I actually want to make another shell hack, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I really want to make another shell hack. Is that from JoJo, or is that from... Attack on Titan? Hmm, I feel like I should take that one... away. I need to revisit Sweet World, I think I might be able to play it now. <laughs> I think Cute Kaizo is harder than Sweet World, so I think you definitely kill Sweet World easy. D shells too? <laughs> You're funny. You think it's from Pokemon? It looks like JoJo or Attack on Titan. The art style looks like the art style looks like freaking uh, Attack on Titan, but then the the character looks like JoJo. Brian, if you're still here, do you stream? Did you stream these hacks? Would I be able to watch these? I love to watch people play my hacks. Are you saying that you maybe played my... my hacks and recorded them? Would there maybe be a VOD I can watch? PSU Terra. Good morning, how are you? Shoot. Sweet World definitely needs a sequel? Oh my god, you guys don't even, don't even... Don't even make me do it. I'll do it. I'll make a Sweet World in, like, less than a month. I can make another Sweet World really quick. If I just made really easy jumps... I could do it. <clears throat> Sweet and Sour World. I think there's a hack called Sweet and Sour, I think. By Lush. Ah! How's everybody doing today? Everybody's week's going good? It's like... I can't believe it is, um... Damn it. I cannot believe it's already Thursday. It makes me really happy. It's too sweet, too sour. <laughs> I was asleep adjacent, had work, so I'm wiped out. Well, I hope work was good. And not too exhausting. Alright, this has got to change. This is- I like this move, but I just feel like it's too hard. It's gonna be too hard for people. It's gonna be way too hard for people. I just feel like it's gonna be too hard for people. <sighs> but I like it. There's a checkpoint all the way down here. This is where the checkpoint's at, and you're gonna get a new thing. You're gonna have this uh, this nifty little block that you can carry around with you. But I've gotta build the setups for it. These are all easy setups. I gotta replace all these setups. These are just little easy setups. Maybe I should make a Sweet World 2 with some of these easier levels that I've already gotten built. <clears throat> Maybe. It was exhausting. I had the surprise of not one, but two videos of people playing your hacks. Whoa, that's really cool. Dang. 
Supra Mario World that centers around street racing? Are you into street racing, Topaz? You like fast cars? I get scared going fast. Call it Sweet World 3, the quest for the sequel. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's actually funny. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> you guys are silly. It'd be cool, though. Yeah, thank you for all the all the likes on the stream. Is this a shell hack? No, I'm trying not to make this a shell hack, so I'm like taking stuff. I'm taking stuff away because I'm trying to not make it a shell hack. It is a little shelly. Ooh, this song is so good. Do you like shell stuff, Brian? I've made, uh, like three shell hacks. At the end of Dank World, there's like, I think, four or five levels that are shell levels. Shelly went to sea by the seashore. Barb played through MFC and Joe's Cook is doing a mini-series. A mini-series? Terry, did you think that short that I uploaded yesterday was mean? Anybody that saw that short yesterday on YouTube, I would love your feedback on it. If you thought I was mean, if you thought it seemed like I had a big ego, I'd love your feedback. You won't hurt my feelings in any way, even if you say I, I sounded like an asshole. I really, <clears throat> I won't get offended by it, but I am, I am interested in it because I was mainly just talking shit. Like I was talking so much smack in that video. Like I was just letting loose. There's a video that's actually coming out on Saturday that I literally took the audio out of it and just replaced it with music because I was very toxic. <laughs> I was talking about mean comments. You thought I was being sarcastic? Yeah, I was being half sarcastic, kind of like talking shit. <laughs> Lunar Magic? How do you make these levels? Sorry I'm new to this. It's okay, Krishna. Yeah, it's called Lunar Magic. Yeah, no big deal. It's fine, Krishna. You know what would be amazing, Egrib? If I did do... If I made Sweet World... But, but had, uh, like, the shells were, like, uh, eggs of the king. Oh my god. <laughs> behillet, behillet shells. I could get, I, I bet, I bet somebody that actually knows how to do graphics could help me with that. You tried it, but you were very confused. What, um... What were we talking about? I'm sorry. I like that better. Yeah, it's much smoother. Oh, God. Like, not in a mean way, but I can see why some people might have taken it poorly. Oh, I got a lot of engagement from it. There were a lot of people that had something to say about that video. I know you guys like them bloody tears. Bloody tears, bloody tears, bloody tears. Shoot, that's tough. Whoa, that's really hard. Bracky. 
Are you a big Bloody Tears fan? <laughs> there are people that love Bloody Tears. I'm crying bloody tears. I'm crying bloody tears. Is this intermediate or beginner? This will probably be more intermediate, more than likely, but I'm going to try to make it lower intermediate. But some of the levels are going to be probably mid-intermediate. I'm very bad at, like, figuring out what I want to... what the uh, difficulty is. Brian, I just build. Sweet World, I definitely tried to uh, build something that was easier. Shoot. Before I was on the internet, I learned Bloody Tears on piano. What? Really? That's pretty really quiet. Really the quest for petties. Oh my god. Egribeth. Don't let me forget that. The quest for petties? The quest for petties. Please, Egribeth. Don't let me forget that name. The quest for petties. That's amazing. I did kind of pop in and out of the comment section for that short for the people that were interested in getting into Kaizo. Yeah, there's a bunch of people on there. I need to like point them towards SMW Central. OG Poggers. <laughs> I'm trying to be more intermediate games. I started Autumn yesterday and today I'm playing Brave New World. Holy shit, I've never played Autumn or Brave New World. I played Summer uh, last year. It was really good. Do you just DM it to me? <laughs> Yeah, don't let me forget. You, can, you just can't let me forget, Egrib. You can't let me forget that that's a good title, The Quest for Petties. I can't do this song. I love David Bowie, but I can't listen to this. It's probably gonna get copyrighted. Egribeth, did you see the video that I tagged you in yesterday? Did you see the video that I tagged you in yesterday, E-Grib? I think I still like the double. I think I like the double. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> what introductory levels do you recommend to a beginner like me? Yeah, Love Yourself is good. Uh, two Kaizo to Learn is good. Baby Kaizo World is really good also. You didn't see it. If you look in the general of the Discord, if you look in the Discord, Egribeth, I like replied to a message that I had sent and then... I like said, do you think this is the right kind of video? If not, I can try to like tag you in it again or something. I don't know, but it's just a video of me. I would have to remove the music though. I think I was directing them towards Sweet World and Buddy Shell and let them know about SMW Central. I was thinking about a couple of the getting started with Kaizo list people uploaded, but I'm lazy. <laughs> Baron of Shell. Zoom in on the buddy? <laughs> yeah, I didn't know if that would be like a funny video. Do you mean a video like that? Like it's a real video? Is Buddy Shell your... Buddy Shell was my first hack. It goes Buddy Shell... Whoops. D Shells... Um, sticky Situation... Dank World, Sweet World, uh, Lucky Pick, uh, and then MFC. I think. What happened to my pencil? I don't have a pencil here. What happened to my pencil? Oh god. Okay, so we have tons of lag. <laughs> Let's get rid of these. This one's kind of cool. This one is nothing. It doesn't do anything. <clears throat> yeah, I thought the zoom in was funny. Uh, 
Uh, it's got five levels. Yeah, Lucky Pick has five levels. It was a uh, a level that me and uh, another player named Just Epic did for um. What is this? I don't want to listen to this. Um, but uh, yeah, it was a German a German blind Kaizo race, is what it was. <clears throat> Too sweet world coming to a Kaizo stream near you. You guys are funny, like actually funny. So Brian, I only made two levels out of that hack. I made the two shell levels. The other levels that you're referring to might be the ones that Just Epic made. <laughs> the ones that graphically look really, really good, those are the levels that Just Epic made. The ones that look... The ones that are shells, the two, the two shell levels are mine. One's a motor skills level, and the other one is a, um... <clears throat> excuse me. One's a motor skills level, and the other one is... Um, what you call it? Uh... The vine level? Yeah, the vines. Yeah, those are all him. He made three levels, and I made two for that hack. No! <laughs> you hate <him. laughs> Yeah, it's a tough level. That's a tough level. Those levels, some of those levels are really tough. They're good levels, but they are definitely challenging. Epic's a, uh, a very good player. He makes stuff a lot harder than I do. But yeah, I really want to make another shell hack really bad. But then I've also really been wanting to to do a uh... yeah 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 lucky pick's not beginner hell no no lucky pick is is like probably mid intermediate I would think maybe not even mid intermediate low mid intermediate the ASM that I used is kind of kind of wild in that other level where you like summon the shell it's just really cool. Baron of Buddy. You know, I did think that would be a really funny title for a shell hack, but it would totally be rip ripping off Baron of Shell. But if I wanted to do like a ode to Baron of Shell, I could do Baron of Butt, but it's too vain. I can't be using my own name, guys. It's too vain. Some people even put their Twitch name in, uh, I should really make them use that block. You know, we should make them use the block. Let's make them use the block. Let's just make them use it. Let's just make them use it. I like this block and I want to use it. I really want to use the block. I like it. Do, 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 do. So let's see, we're gonna take the block, they're gonna take the block and grab it. They need to grab this block. 
I did straight up and yeet that block, yeah. Why? Well, I, th I thought it would- Buddy Shell's okay, you're funny as hell. I like the way this level you're building is coming together, those wall jump star blocks are really cool. Yeah, I, you know what, I tried to do something different, I'm wanting to do something different, so I thought the wall jump blocks and this block that you can throw- you can throw- this, this block is really, really cool, so... You can throw this block and, like, jump through different things. I'm gonna have to put a sprite killer, though, <clears throat> so that whenever you go through it, you end up not, uh, I don't, I, I want, um, I want you to, like, not have the block, but I want you to be able to use the block and see, like, oh, this is what you can do with it, you know? Because it is a really cool, it, it is a very cool little block, I will have to say. I, I like it. And I haven't ever used it before, but I used it accidentally in uh, one of my other levels. But I, I didn't, like, want to use it. But yeah, it's a really cool little block. So you grab it, and then you throw it. <laughs> it looks like a coin, though, when you pick it up. You see? And you can carry it with you if you want, which is kind of cool. But yeah, I think I'm gonna try to put one of those blocks right there. I'm pretty sure you can stick it to walls, too. Yeah, it'll stick to walls, which is really cool. I'm gonna use it for this level, I think. I'm gonna put one right there, too. To where you have to be grabbing onto the block. And you're gonna throw it onto the wall. That'd be cool. I'll have to make like a little tutorial section for this, but maybe I can try to do like a subworld or something. Maybe we can do that. They're gonna jump, jump, throw that block. And to teach them that the block will stick to the wall, we need to take all of that away and then they can throw the block at the wall. That'll be cool. Okay, that's- I like that. That is really cool. I think it could have some serious use, get the player eased into it, and then in later levels make it important to advancing through this. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try to use it more. It's a really cool, uh, gimmick. I like it. I haven't used it before. I was thinking about it yesterday, and I didn't get a chance to add it into a level, because I played Kazoo World 2 yesterday, and it was a lot of fun. Alright, let's see here. Because we're gonna have to somehow get the block. But if you throw it up, I wonder if it sticks- if, if it sticks to a ceiling. Oh yeah, you can definitely use it for key jumping. That's why I have to make sure that the player can't take it with them too long, because they could just drop it on any of these spots. They could they could probably just drop it right here, honestly. If they're really good. But if I could put a ceiling here, it won't be as bad. Because then they won't be able to jump as much. Because what they have to do is they have to jump and then drop. Jump and drop over and over again. Let's just test it out really quick. This is I like where this is going. This is really cool. But yeah, I don't know. I, I, I have way too many ideas. Like, I just have way too many ideas. I'm not going to lie. Oh, wait, does that work? Hang on. I don't know if I can do... I don't know if I can hold this and jump off the... Um, I don't know if I can jump off of this. While holding this. It doesn't work! <gasps> it doesn't work! You can't- you can't jump off of an enemy while holding the block. It just doesn't work. It conflicts with it. It's almost like you're holding a shell or something. Yeah, it doesn't work. Dang. Okay, well, it's fine. We can keep it the way we had it. We had, uh...
We can just keep it the way it was because the wall jump blocks were fun. That was a fun move too because you have to wait. Ah, shame. It has brought dishonor upon your house. <laughs> yeah, it has. Let's see here. Okay, and then we're going to jump off of this one. I could make that so much harder though to where you have to like jump down throw the block over you bounce off the enemy and grab the block in the air i just opened your stream and an ad came i'm sorry steven i appreciate you supporting my stream by watching the ad though it's very nice you probably made me a half of a penny and i really appreciate that thank you I wonder if you can spin with the block. Hmm. We'll see. Okay, let me see here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. We're gonna have this block. We're gonna we get, we can jump with the block. put them in the pit and they're gonna have to use the block my brain was all excited like if it can be a part of a platform and you can throw it upwards while riding it through a sprite killer it have been pretty neat Wait, let me think about this, what you're saying. My brain was all excited, like, if it can be part of a platform and you can throw it upwards while riding it. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool to throw it up like that. Well, see, I don't know if you can use it as a, like, I don't know if it'll interact. It'll interact with on-off switches, I think, but I don't know. It's very odd. Make them build their way up. Yeah, I thought that would be kind of neat. I'm trying to make it, like I said, I always try to design stuff with the intention of fun. Whoops. How's everybody's week been? Has everybody had a good week? Oh my gosh, you can, you can kill it. Oh wait, what? I can't go through these? What the hell? Wait, what? 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 What are these? A large, hang on, no, no, no. Walked into solid for Mario, but acts like a 1F0 for spread. Oh, I put the wrong ones there. Whoopsie. <laughs> Those are not what I need. I need these sprite killers. <laughs> Sorry, messages can sometimes confusing. This is 4 a.m. Terry. You're fine. You are totally fine. You are totally fine. 
I'm excited. I'm excited about the progress of this level right now, guys. I'm not even going to joke around. I'm really excited. Okay, so we're going to take that block. We're going to throw it against the wall. We're going to jump over this. Dan man, Dan man, you will not get any kind of stretches or sippies. No, I'm kidding. I got you, Dan man. I'll give Dan man the big stretch. Oh, Dan man. <laughs> you don't get to watch me drink though, sorry. <laughs> you don't get to watch me take sippies though. Dan man, how are you doing today? Dang it. I know one thing, I hope work goes good for me today. I hope it's like kinda warm outside. I really want it to be kinda warm. <laughs> Being chilly, just got back from work, more or less. Well, I hope work was good. Uh, no heavily copyrighted song, heavily copyrighted song, get the fuck out of here, heavily. Yeah. <laughs> 
They're just jealous of the new block. They're used for to, they're used to Mario using their cousins as blocks. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, we definitely using the blocks. This is cool. This is really cool. There's a certain sprite graphic I need for these, though. Uh, what is the sprite graphic for these? Where the heck is this block at? It says here, make sure his sprite file 101 is in SP2 for the graphics to display directly. File 101? SP2? Is this gonna break anything in the level? Is this gonna break anything? Is this gonna let make anything look crazy in the level? I don't think it broke anything. Yo, Jays, what's up? Nice, nice booba. <laughs> Your ramen is ready. Let's see if I fix the graphics for this block. So, will it stay as a block now? No, I didn't do anything and I don't actually know what I'm doing. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. It can stay looking like a coin. I just opened your video and an ad came. Oh, I already read that. Yeah, I'm sorry, Stefan. I'm doing well. We got this cool block that we're doing stuff with. Ah. I'm doing good, Jace. I'm having a good morning. I slept pretty good. And this level is, is, is nice. I like this level so far. It's, it's really cool. It looks similar enough to your zombie brain. <laughs> Dot Kawaki says, wah, 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 hoo, wah, wah, hey, wah, 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 hoo. Yippee, 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 hiya, 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 yippee, yippee, yippee. Damn it. That was Cookie's fault. Cookie, do you think a block like this could be used for the standard hack? Do you think that would be a, a fun block to have? Do you think this is something that could be used in standard if you did it to where it was just like, you're just like throwing the block into like, like it'd be like easy throws, you know what I mean? Not technically like key jumps or anything like that, but just like throwing the block. Do you think that would be a fun gimmick to have in the standard hack? This block is really neat, dude. No! Maybe for a ghost house? I asked you about an idea the other day too, but I forget what the hell it was. forgot whatever it was that I had asked you about. I had asked you about something and you were like, show it to me. But I forgot what it was. I forgot what the idea. Dude, I have too many freaking ideas and not enough time. I still need to test your standard level, dude. But I'm sure it's great. It looked awesome.
My brain went evil since that block has a passing resemblance to a petrified ghost block. You could hide one among the ghosts. Just to confuse people for the lulls. That actually would be kind of funny. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny, because it does kind of look like a, uh, the same kind of block that a, a flying ghost block. That's really funny. <laughs> it's evil, but funny. I like that idea though. I need to I need to try to implement that. I'm gonna put this blue block over here so I don't forget about it because I like that idea. I like that idea a lot. That's kind of funny. As long as you're facing the direction, obviously the moment he turns around an observant player will catch on. Can't be too evil. Yeah, you're right. Whoops. <clears throat> Dang it. Wait, what? Where did my block go? My block is gone! And I'm soft locked! <laughs> I'm soft locked! <laughs> Yeah, it's really weird, right? It's very, very odd block, for sure. It's a very odd block. It, 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 it does react in uh, weird ways. It like totally just got, got eaten, just that. Kind of like a shell would. If it collides with anything killable, it'll vanish. It's important to remember. Yeah, it's kind of wild, right? Let's see here. Um, I really want them to... Mega Man. Gotta love that Mega Man. Yo, what's up, Oreos? How's it going? This looks sick. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. I hope it's fun. We've actually, yeah, made some really good progress today. Yeah, this little block is neat. I like it.
Oh my god. I think I like just grabbing it and then jumping with it. I wish it was easier to grab though. That's the only bad thing about this block. Is that it's really weird to grab it. Like I wouldn't want the- whoops. I wouldn't want the players to um... I wouldn't want players to have to, like, grab that block really fast and then get stuck. Because they're, like, having trouble, like, picking it up because it's, like, weird grab. To be, like, right on top of it when you grab it. No. <laughs> you pretty much just have to go immediately there. Oh my gosh. That's tough. That's like actually harder than it looks. Maybe I should make it four blocks instead of three, because three is kind of tight. Yeah, I guess if you mess up, then <laughs> you're done for. <laughs> God, that's tough. Because what it does is it sticks to whatever block. It's just going to be within the tile set, so it's going to stick to whatever block it can within those squares. Whoops. Yeah, people don't really like wall jump blocks, but I like wall jump blocks. I think they're fun. No! I guess we're gonna wait here for a second. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Really? Is it already that time? Why? It's okay. We're not going to work that early anyways. Because the truck is not there. I have to wait every morning. I am going to put a sprite killer though.
Yo, sweet dude, thanks. Yeah, man, uh, this level's kind of cool. I like this little block, man. I, I was thinking about this block the other day, and uh, I was thinking about different ways I could utilize it. So I thought this morning I was gonna try to build with it, and uh, I really like where this is going. I hope you're doing well today, dude. I hope you're you're I hope your building flow is going well also, man. I can't spin with it? So you can't spin with that block. Okay, at least we know now. You cannot spin with that block. What if you had to keep up with this, though? This saw? That would be kind of cool, right? To, like, keep up with the saw. Like, you have to... You have to throw it and then jump over. Like, that would be kind of cool, right? Like, you have to... You have to... You have to throw the... You have to jump off the block, throw it. Then you have to, um... To spin off of it. You know, just like, spin off of it to land on it. And, the, and the, yeah, I finally got the ASM I wanted to build the next level with. Working took me like five hours, but you got it working. Hell yeah, bro. What's up, Steven? Dude, that's sick. That's awesome. Things it can't do. Survive enemy collision, be spun with, be respawned by scrolling. Yeah, it's weird, right? It is a weird, uh... It's a weird little block, you know? It's a weird little block. Alright, let me see here. I need a drink of my cappuccino. Combining two level ASMs with their own configuration settings is super annoying, don't recommend. Whoa. Wait, combining two? Yeah, it's got a lot of fun uses, I think. I think this is a really cool block. I like it. I bet that is pretty wild, sweet dude. What the hell? Comparing two different or, or combining two different ASMs into one seems pretty, uh... Pretty interesting. <laughs> pretty tough, though. song sounds like full house oh my god I'm so stupid it's normally not that bad but they're both chunky boys <laughs> so if you paste one into another you get out of bound errors what the ASM calls two is too far away luckily one of them could just be global ASM so I just threw it in there Oh, that's cool. Huh. Yeah, I bet that was interesting to, uh, to get to work. I bet it's really fun being able to, like, mess around with code and create your own ASM. I couldn't imagine. It'd be so fun to, uh, to just have an idea and then to be able to, uh, to code it into, 
into fruition would be sick. You barely know ASM. You just know how the system works. Oh my god. Okay, I guess we'll sit here for a second. <laughs> God damn it, I'm stupid. Go, Speed Racer, go. This reminds me of Speed Racer so much, I don't know why. It's not, it's Ape Escape, I think, but it reminds me of Speed Racer. Go speed racer, go speed racer. Anybody ever watched, used to watch Speed Racer? I remember when I was a really little kid, I had this babysitter. And I used to go hang out over there. It was like a really old lady. She was really rough. But we'd always watch Speed Racer. <laughs> Basically because the combination of the two blocks of assembly were too big and exceeded the allocated block and assumed parts of the code were in another non-existent. I have no idea. I have no idea, Tara. Sweet dude. If you're talking to sweet dude, I, I have no idea. I'm not smart enough. Or I might be smart enough, but I have not learned uh, learned any kind of assembly coding yet. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, I think SMW is pretty finicky. Oh my god, I'm, I'm actually lost now. I'll just build. <laughs> I'll just play this level. I don't know anything about that. Basically what happens. Huh. That's intense. Very address dependent. Hey, you guys are all in the lingo now. Well, this song is badass. What do you guys think about me putting my uh, category as software development? 
level <laughs> or uh, software and game development instead of SMW. Kind of interesting, right? Might get more people into building. People be like, what is this? What is this program? I've never heard of this. You see people stream SMW under retro. That's actually really funny. I'm not that bad. Oh, God. What? Oh, look at this cheese. Ooh. That's some cheese. That's some cheese. That's some straight up chairs. Hmm. Chairs. Some people do that because they're afraid of the SMW community? Really? Wonder why they would be afraid. I used to do some coding, but never dug an ASM because there was some serious address limitations. Ugh. Oh, they're shy? Oh. Wonder why. Wonder why they're so shy. <sighs> Noah, how are you doing today? Is Man of Steel really that bad, though? He always comes into my stream and has, like, the weakest fucking jokes. I used to not even ban him, but now I ban him because he's just, like, a waste of my time, but... <laughs> I saw him this week. <sighs> he likes to drop by my streams. I've not had a lot of experience with him. I've heard he's a bad guy, though. Yeah, that's what I've heard. I've heard he's been, like, really, really bad in the past. That's why I don't, uh... I don't even allow him to joke in my channel anymore, because he, uh... He seems to be... having some hate in him. <laughs> I don't like that. I think trolling people is whatever, but... but being, like, hateful towards people, you know, for the way they are is not okay. Um... Let's put this over here. Let's just put this right there. My coating was sloppy bulky, but got the job done if I had to trim it to fit small addresses around banks. That'd be insane. That's kind of wild. And uh, Noah, I hope you're doing great today. Isn't Man of Steel like the only troll in SMW though? And at this point, do we even know that Man of Steel is still the same person that it's always been? Who knows? It could be somebody, it could be a bunch of people. Nobody even knows. Uh, I do have to get going soon, but I am, I'm going into work later because my job has been, uh, pissing me off. And I get to work, and I can't actually do any work. And then my boss is like, oh, you should help sort. And I'm like, bro, what? I already scan, like, a bunch of stuff. I already have to unload my van. I already have to sort this other this other set of routes that I do. I'm not doing a bunch of work for a bunch of people. And I don't get paid enough for that, so I'm not going in early. I'm, I'm not going in early anymore. I used to go in early every day, and then I'd, I started having to do other people's jobs and I'm not doing that. I'm not doing other people's fucking work. I'm a goddamn subcontractor. I'm not I'm not a fucking employee that has like all these other assholes that I depend on. I go in and do my stuff and get the fuck out of there. And yeah, I'm not I'm not fucking around with my job. They're pissing me off. They are pissing me off. So I am I am not going to work early. I will not be going to work early. Hell no. I'm going to work in like 15 more minutes. I basically get home at the same time. So I'm just like, what's the point of me getting there early if I'm going to do other people's jobs? I'm not doing it. Sorry, I wasn't trying to rant. I just ranted. <laughs> yeah, I used to think that Man of Steel was funny, but then I, I didn't know that he was like a really hateful person. Because he would come in here and say like some weak ass sexual joke and it really wasn't that funny but it was like kind of a uh, kind of comedic but he would always leave pretty much immediately so it was like never an issue but then I realized that he was 
really, really bad guy, I guess, so. But I felt bad for, like, <laughs> choking around with him. I was like, fuck. I don't know all the SMW drama, you know? There's, like, all this SMW drama I stay out of, so it's like... <laughs> I don't want to fucking be in any drama. Oh, but yeah. I'm not installing a bot or anything to ban his ass, but if he pops in... I don't know. I just hope people aren't upset that I... <laughs> joke around with him because I tell him his jokes are weak I'm like bro make me laugh he doesn't even make me laugh <sighs> back in my logistics days my reward for coming in on time was unloading truck because the driver was lazy that sucks who's cheese I used to know his alt account actually holy shit that's pretty wild You'd see him in cheese. I don't know who that is, but you'd just see him in another person's stream and he'd be acting cool. Huh. Oh, SM64. Oh, I don't watch... I don't... I don't... I don't play, uh, 64... Super Mario 64. Huh? Neat? Wait, what? Yo, TJB, what the heck? Thanks for the raid. How were your Beach Mouse runs? Were, were you playing Beach Mouse today? Thanks for the raid, man. What the heck? You guys go give TJB a follow. He's a very good player. Uh, exceptionally good player. Very nice person also. He's a very, very exceptionally nice person. So you should definitely follow him. He's nice and he's a good player. So that's like a double combo. He's a really good guy. You're fine, dude. I got all those, I got all that MOS lore, it's actually a pretty deep rabbit hole, which is why I don't blame people for not knowing. Oh really, sweet dude? That's cool. You can, you can message me anytime and tell me about it. Oh, you were working on the last level in possible. you know what, that's what it was, I was watching your YouTube video this morning of the beach mouse clear, the 10 minute speed run, that's what it was, I'm dumb. <laughs> well, I hope your stream was good. Possibility of the island looks insane. And yeah, GG on Beach Mouse, dude. You're badass. Yeah, sweet dude. I find it kind of fascinating. The whole, the whole, uh, the whole story about that is just interesting to me. Even though it's like a, it's hateful and stuff, but it's still like interesting. Like, why would somebody go through the, go through that? You know, why would somebody do that? Like, go through the. Um, the trouble of that, unless they just really enjoy trolling. Which is whatever. It's just, it's, I don't know. It's kind of wild. But yeah, someone had proposed it to me that like, I'm, I'm, I'm white and straight. So that, for me, it's, it's like, not, uh, like, like, he can't really offend me that much. But he can offend other people, like, greatly, I guess, by his words, so I'm like, huh, and it made sense to me when that person said it, and I thought, oh, that's kind of, I guess that's kind of, like, dumb of me to, 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 like, not take into full consideration of things, so. But yeah, it's interesting. I was torn, because I had to just take other people's word for it, too, like, oh, this guy's a bad guy, you have to trust me, he's a bad guy, and I'm like, okay. I don't know. It's weird. It's a weird thing, right? It's really, honestly, nothing I should even think about, but... I never want anybody to think I was some kind of asshole. You could spit on those fireballs, by the way. I don't know if you consider that cheese. What do you mean? Oh, you mean spin from the platform, you mean? Yeah, I guess you could do that, couldn't you? Yeah, I guess you could. Yo, what's up, Baba? I hope you're doing well, dude. Do you think I could? Yeah, I guess I could. It still wouldn't work, though. I don't think it would work. I feel like the, the spawning is a little bit weird. But I see what you're saying, though. Hmm, hmm, hmm. 
Hmm. First name but doesn't want to be an asshole? No, I don't want to be looked at. I don't care if people think I'm an asshole, but I don't want people to think that I am a, um, a person that is allowing people to, to be mean to people in my stream. Yeah, I don't want it to do that. If you could probably get the second one to spawn early, but... Hmm. I know how to fix this, though. Let's see him re-grab that. <laughs> Let's see him re-grab that. <laughs> re-grab these nuts. He <laughs> got him. <laughs> Whoops. No, I'm not trying to play Data Burst. I want to play Data Burst, but it's kind of tough. I gotta. I can't play it without letting Seliker know. Secular. Se Selic I can't say their name correctly. Ugh. If I felt like this was actually a toxic stream, I would not be here. <laughs> well, I'm glad, dude. I'm glad you can tell. Yeah, I try not to be mean. I just get mad at myself. <laughs> <laughs> like yesterday. Man, I got pissed yesterday at Kazoo World. I was so mad. Ugh. Oh my god, that's so disgusting now, though. It's so much harder. And the spawning of this is weird. Maybe I should just take these out and just have... Just like something like that. Took you four hours? Yeah, it's gonna be tough for me. I definitely am gonna have to play it on, like, an afternoon stream. Because I'll, I'll have to, uh, I'll definitely have to, like, get it to, like... I'll definitely have to... Sell a Cree? Really? Is it, it sell a Cree? Really? Sideways Thwomps? I don't know if I have them for this, this, uh... I don't think I have them. My Sideways Thwomps are gonna look crazy. They're gonna look nuts. Do I have thwomps? Yeah, my thwomps are gonna look like ghosts. <laughs> I don't even think I have the right kind of thwomp. I don't even think I have left thwomps or right thwomps. These are all like sideways left, sideways down. These are all like diagonal thwomps. Oh, there's thwomps. Yeah, I'd have to mess with the bits. I don't know anything about the bits for this. I'd have to do, like, extensions and stuff, and I don't know what those are. I didn't know there's a Pokemon called Slugma. <laughs> I can count the number of times you were legitimately angry that I've seen on one hand, and one person in chat definitely deserved you shutting him down hard. Slugma balls. <laughs> The main issue with the difficulty is that some rooms are instant death if you can't remember what's coming up next. So slightly blind in that region. Worth playing still. All you gotta do is make a GFX file and just put the thwomp in the slot of the boo. The only issue is you can't see that boo. Yeah. You forget, dude, that you actually know how to, how to do stuff in this game. I'm a cheater, sweet dude. I just use a base ROM and just build with it. And half of the stuff I don't know how to implement properly. That's why my... That's why... Alright, sweet dude, check this out. What does this mean to you? If I if I say for this block right here that I'm carrying around, if I say... If I say... Um, uh, da -da 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 -da. Make sure is... Make sure is sprite file 101 is in SP2 for the GFX to display properly. So, I thought changing SP2 to 101 would make the block not, like, look like a coin. But, I don't even, yeah, I don't even, like, know. I did that and it doesn't work, so. You can tell my, my knowledge is very limited. <laughs> very limited knowledge. Sadly.
God damn it. Okay. You have 101 inserted? No. So that means like, you're talking about doing stuff with files. You're saying actually insert the graphics file. See, I wouldn't even know where to find that file. I'd have to like go into the graphics files and then I guess find 101, but then it's like put it, I don't even know where I'd put it. Like I said, man, I uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I've built a lot of hacks, but I don't know what I'm doing. But I do have fun and I hope I make fun stuff. Uh, where's my... Where the... Where the fuck is my saw? Good morning, online bully. Yeah, you gotta get the exgfx file, put that in the exgx folder, and then hit the yellow mushroom with an arrow. Oh... All right, I gotta go in a second, but let me just look at this really quick. Will this pull up? No, you guys can't see that, okay. So wait, go to the GFX file folder. Extra graphics, find graphic 101. Copy it, and then put it in the extra graphics folder. It's already in the extra graphics folder. Yeah. Wait, do I just hit the yellow mushroom then? Wait. Let's just see, it's already in there. I didn't ever hit the yellow mushroom. Maybe that works? Let's just see if it works really quick before I gotta go. Cause I do need to go to work, damn it. Um, yeah, dude. No, it doesn't work. I don't know. Yeah, it's not a big deal. I kind of like the coin, not gonna lie. I, uh, that's why I have a lot of gra uh, glitched graphics and a lot of my hacks, because I kind of like gr glitched graphics, but I also don't have any idea what I'm doing. But yeah, I don't think I did that correctly. Yeah, I don't know. It's no big deal, though. It's fine. I make do with what I've got. I've got this whole, all this stuff to work with, so I just make it work. If you just send me the ROM, I could probably fix it in five seconds. But sweet dude, I won't learn how to do it that way. I, I, I suck, man. I, I, I've got to learn this stuff. Even though I do appreciate the help. That's what most people say. They just say, send it to me, I'll fix it for you. And I'm like, okay. But then I've done that too much and I, I still, I don't have any idea. I do have YYCHR, but I don't, I don't really know how to use it. I've forgotten, after, after, after using it for Dank World, I've kind of forgotten how to use it. And I really haven't, I haven't, I've never redrawn anything. There's a lot of stuff I haven't, uh, that I can't do. So, you know, I just gotta learn. I just like to build though. That's why I like, I hate the graphics and stuff. Cause there's all these extra, all these extra steps you have to go to. And it's just, it's a pain in the butt. It makes me sad because I, I'd like to make stuff look better, but I just don't really know how to do it. And I just forget, I just forget how to do it, man. It sucks. Is there anybody streaming? Mario. I don't know who this dude is. We're gonna raid him though. I can't I can't let this raid that TJB was so nice to give us. I can't just let it go to waste. So we're gonna give it to this dude. He's playing Casio. Casio's a cool hack. I don't mind doing graphic. Oh wait, if we were really wanting to make him overjoyed, someone needs to teach him how to keep the overworld bird from vanishing. I think I figured that out, Tara, I think, but I'm not 100%. I don't mind doing graphics, but yeah, I assume it's a pain. I go through the pain because I like using custom mechanics. It's like the main reason I hack. It's not that I don't enjoy vanilla, it's just that I've done so much vanilla already. Yeah, I like chocolate stuff too. I just can't utilize things correctly, but I've used a lot of chocolate stuff in my hacks. You should check out Dank World, sweet dude. It was like my version of like trying to do like all custom stuff. I did all custom backgrounds and then like all the sprites are like, I did like manipulated the extensions so that they would, um, they would all be like different or whatever. So it's kind of neat, you know? 
But yeah, this we're gonna raid this guy. Um, he's playing. He's playing. Uh, he's playing Cassio. I've never watched him before. Seems like a nice guy. Trash Lord Oscar is his name. So, but yeah, I enjoy building. I just really enjoy building like so much. Am I seriously in a fucking ad for like three? Okay, thirty seconds. You just want to keep working on ASM and overworld instead of levels? I just want to work on- I just want to work on levels. Can someone just let me build levels and you can make it look however you want? <laughs> Straight up, I think I like making overworlds more than levels sometimes. Oh shit, you want me to show you my overworld really quick? Uh... Uh... I can show you my overworld really quick. If you want to see it, sweet dude, but it's- it's- it's weak. Wonder if I can pull it up. Will it pull up? It won't pull up. Why won't it pull up? Why won't it pull up? That's weird. You guys can't see like any of the extra stuff I'm doing. That's really weird. Huh. I don't know, no big deal. I am too lazy to decorate it. <laughs> I suck at making terrain. Terrain, but decoration I love doing. Huh. I hope you guys have a good day. Thank you for being here. Thank you for hanging out. Off to bed, Tara. Have a great night. Sleep well. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate everybody being here. I appreciate everybody kicking it. If you want some more of this sweet butt, you gotta go to YouTube to get it. <sighs> I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Yeah, I'd love to learn more stuff, but it's just like, for me, it's like there's just so much I can do, like, building-wise. It's like, I just want to build. Like, I'm overflow. I'm literally ejaculating ideas just everywhere. Just, just blowing my load of Kaizo ideas all over you guys, you know? Alright, have a great day. <laughs> See you guys later. <laughs> Don't forget to be sweet. And thank you guys for being here. In all, all actuality, thank you guys for being here and hanging out. This was fun. Phyrexium said, what the fuck? <laughs> Have a good day, guys. All right, I'm out of here. Take it easy. YouTube, thank you for being here. Thank you for hanging out. Have a great day.